Hey friends, I get a lot of questions about anxiety and one of the questions I get asked most frequently is what do I do in the moment when I'm feeling anxiety, when I'm feeling stressed, when I'm in conflict, when I'm about to take a test, when I'm just in line at the grocery store and I feel that anxiety, that panic starting to build, what do I do? I have a whole list of these things because that happens to me uh, quite frequently. So I call these SOS tools and I'm gonna tell you one of my favorites right now. It's super simple. You can do it anywhere at any time. All it requires is you take a couple of deep breaths. Well, first you have to notice that you're feeling the anxiety, that panicky feeling rising up in your throat. Maybe you're clenching the jaw, all those signs in your body that you're feeling anxious. Take a deep breath, realize that it's happening. Don't panic about the fact that it's happening. And then you just use your fingers to do this. So what I find really helpful is to have a phrase or a saying that goes along with pressing your thumb into each finger slowly. So there are two that I really like. Peace begins with me. I like that one. It makes me feel like even though the world is kind of out of my control sometimes, a lot of the time, I can feel that peace. It begins with me. So taking deep breaths, peace begins with me. Another phrase that I really like, this too shall pass. This too shall pass. Whatever I'm going through, even if it seems horrible, and actually even if it's great, it's all gonna pass. So be with it and breathe through it. So whatever phrase you want to use will work here. Anything that kind of has four beats, you know, you could, Use, you know, shut up, you suck. Um, I wouldn't recommend it, it might not bring you peace. But whatever you can use to go along with the physical feeling of pressing your fingers together, that'll help you get back into the body and out of the spiral that your mind goes into. You'll get back into the body. You'll breathe slow and deep through the nose. And you'll just repeat your phrases. Figure it out work situation. You can do that really easy under your desk. You can do it really subtly if you need to. But that is one thing that's really helped me to get on top of the breath, to connect with the body, and to help back out when I'm feeling that doom spiral of panic. Because then once you calm down, once you can get on top of the breath, once you can feel more connected, then you can deal with whatever the situation is rather than going into that knee-jerk reaction that a lot of us tend to do where we go into fight or flight or we, we say something rash, gives you a moment to breathe, to connect, and then you can deal with it. I hope that helps. I'll be back with more tips soon.